Okay, I'm going to tape this not knowing what I'm doing, but I've got this frame. When I bought the frame, I bought a small frame just to see if I'd like it. Oh, wait a minute, I don't have the things with it. Hang on, I gotta go get the things. Okay, I have the things. Good thing I have a little pause do mufflage on here. Okay, these are the things. Now this is just a small frame, but if this works like I'm hoping it's gonna work, I might have to get a larger frame. And so, because, okay, this I have a linen napkin that I got from the thrift shop. And um, because, of it's, because it's just of a plain color, um, okay, I'm gonna be painting on this, I think. I'm not sure. This is my, this is an experiment for sure. Because it's just something I want to do. I want to have my own painted fabric. Now, when you paint something like this, that I'm hoping to have, now I have it stretched across. See, you can put, this is cool because I just laid the napkin over the frame and then I put the clamps on. Then you can turn the clamps because the clamps have got a grid underneath. So you can turn them to pull that flat. Fabric paint. Artesia sent me this to try some while ago, and I did do one little video on it, but I haven't really played with it much. So I'm going to put me some water in this bowl. Okay, there we go. And then I have a little bit of a palette here that I can add paint to. Let's see. yellow. Oh no, that's gold. It's a dark blue. And there's a white. And there's a lighter blue. You call that one blue? Oh, this is purple and blue and red. And pink. Oh, they got simple names for the colors rather than having all. And then silver.
I want watered down a little bit. So I'm going to add because okay, I'm going to make that more of a watery consistency. And so okay, so I'm going to start by making the flour. like a heart but I want a flower this can be a heart flower now this this I'm gonna be um, for drying purposes I'm going to be um, pausing this video to let it dry at times and then but you won't pause, just I will pause. Okay, let's see. Um, here I don't know what I'm doing with color, so I'm, but I'm just getting this yellow in here somehow. It kind of runs together. chopstick here. Always when you go to Chinese place, make sure you get chopsticks. Even if you're not going to eat with chopsticks, if you bring it home and you're going to eat it with fork, get chopsticks anyway because you may need them. Okay, this one I'm mixing with a little bit of yellow and here with a little bit of white. lighter green and then this third one is just green but I think I want to get a little bit of there's no brown here either um, here I want a little bit more yellow in this green
actual petals. So what it looks like here won't actually be um, what it look what it looks what I've got in my mind anyway. Okay, so let's see. This here is fun. I'm already thinking that I may want to get, go ahead and get, I'll have to see what they cost. But I think I want to get, because I don't think this one was all that much. If I remember correctly, I just did order a very small one because I wanted to just see what it did. Okay, let's see. Um, okay, let's see. I wonder if maybe I would want to take some gold. I'm shaking this. I think I'm supposed to shake it. Shake it, but don't break it. Took your mama nine months to make it. Okay, now. Okay. I went to the dog. I have to go for tests. I'm just going to go around here with a little gold. I gotta go for some tests. I guess when you start getting like up in your years, you know, start getting that antique look, then them doctors, they wanna send you for tests. Not sure why. Not sure why they wanna do that to me. Be rude like that. Tests, tests, and more tests. So I'm going to be busy the next, well, between now and three months. I have another appointment in three months, but i got to get all these tests before the three months. I've never been good at test taking. Even in a...
put some yellow spots here. I could probably use my um, dryer, my heat gun to dry this, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to, after I get some of this in here, I'm just going to pause it and go eat dinner. And, um, and then let this dry. But I want to get some... Hmm. I want to get some... Ooh. See? We don't know what we're doing. You don't have to, though. See? But see, my, my goal is, one thing I do know I want to do is to, I'm going to be doing stitching on here. So my slow stitching is going to go on here. Now I have done some slow stitching where I just take a fabric that already has flowers on it. And I, um... And I stitch around the flowers. Now this one here I'm going to do a little bit differently than I do with the stitching around. Oh, I like this brush. This is pretty cool how this works because it really comes out with just a little end. Okay, and then um, these, these flowers are like whisking around in the air. They don't have to. They don't have to be touching the ground. No, they don't have to be touching the ground. They can just be whisking around in the air, and that's what they're doing. here. Y'all have probably seen that spot a lot. I'm going to get that cut off. They're going to, well, it's, it's cancerous, but it's just some kind of very minor cancer, which, because he's already done a biopsy on it, and, but then when he was ready to cut it off, I said, ah, oh, geez, nah, let's not do that. And so, but now it's getting to where it's not healing, so I thought, well, yeah, we're going to go ahead and let him cut that off. So, I don't have an appointment for that yet, although he said he wants to do it very quickly. I didn't know that this stuff could grow inward, so I don't want it to do that. So, 
they're going to call me with an appointment for that. But um, I had to see it because I'm on a blood thinner. I have to be off of my blood thinner like four or five days before they actually do it. Then I got that spot you guys have seen on my nose too. Well, that one, he won't do that one, he said, but it needs to be done. So he said, I don't do noses, so I'm going to send you a dermatologist. So I've got to go to a dermatologist. I do not like going to doctors. Doctors make me nervous. Not my doctor. Dr. John is cool. He is cool as ever. I don't want to go to a new doctor, but I'll go because I do want to get this taken care of on my nose because it's not healing. And I don't want to lose a nose. Can you imagine how funny looking I'd be without no nose? I mean, I'm funny looking already, so not having a nose would be even worse. So we're going to go get that taken care of. So I get the girl smooshed. And then i got to get my... Huh. And I gotta get my spots cut off. I think it's just, you know, I don't know what it is. But I'll get I'll get that done. Now I gotta go get a bone density. It's only and to get the bone density you only have to have to do that because the insurance requires you to get that done every so often or whatever so I have to go put that down then they're going to do a they want to do a where they go and they check your um, what are they, carotid arteries they do a little sonogram or something see if your carotid arteries are pregnant oh no that's right they don't do that for that reason but I guess my echocardiogram, they said I had a, no, what did I have? I have something in the echocardiogram. And something about a murmur and a blockage or something. Well, I I know why, you know, I know why I have little little problems with my heart. There's two little, two little places in my heart, which is normal for, you know, I'm 71 years old, so of course things are going to go rusty. But, um... But, um, <laughs> he said there's two places, two places in my heart. He's not too concerned about them right now, but he's just going to keep an eye on it. But, you know, I know what it is. I know what it's from. See, when I was 14, we had to leave Minnesota and move to Florida. And I had to leave. Well, there was two really cute guys. One was in school and one was a neighbor. And actually, I was in love with them both, but they didn't know it. They didn't know that. It was, I hadn't broke that to them, you know, to these two people. And so, and it broke my heart when I had to leave them. And so that's what's showing up now. It was it broke my heart. Okay, now, let's see. Now, what, what color? I want to do, okay, and now I want to get some blue. Up in the sky, up in the sky, up in the sky. I need some blue. I didn't put any blue out here yet. I don't want this dark old blue like this. I want it to be... Oh, I guess you do have to shake that because that come all clear. Okay, so put that there. But I want to put white. Yeah, just white. I want it to be a light blue. Okay. Okay. And so I want to go up here. And I'm just going to make some lines up here. Oops, I don't want to, you know what I should have done? Yeah, I think I might want to get a larger frame. Um, I mean, if I like this, I got to wait and see if I actually think this turns out cool. 
so I'm just putting some blue up here like in the sky sky blue pink Just see, I got a little bit. I didn't mix it real good. I didn't mix it like completely, so I got some little dark blue and a little bit of light, real light. That's pretty cool. And I do not know what I'll do when I get the threads on here. You know what I might do is I might just go ahead and let this be part one. And then I'm going to let it dry. And then go with the next one. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Rather than you just pause it, I'll do another one to make it part two. See that little bit of blue like that. See, I thought about maybe I would spray this, but I don't think I'm going to. Okay. Just like cleaned off a little bit. And put them right there, and those will be fine. And then I'm going to, I'm just going to let that dry. And that doesn't look like much. It is a flower of sorts and little whatevers. Oh, hi, Papa. I'm looking for dogs. Why are you looking for dogs? Oh, is it treat time? Okay. Yeah, I was looking for my... Well, I was looking for something here. Where did I put my... My reading cards. I got my reading cards here somewhere. Oh. Dang. Dang, dang, double dang. Oh, there's another brush. I put that over there. Okay, and anyway, so let's see. What do we have here? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, baby cakes. <coughs> okay, baby cakes. Okay, baby cakes. Um, well, darn it. Okay. Oh, here it is. My little... Okay, let's put... Ooh. Let's put this right here. And get my little cards here. And let's pick one out right here. It says positive thinking. In the garden of my mind, I water the good thoughts and weed out the bad ones. I throw in forgiveness and empathy seeds by the handful if I want. And I take a lawnmower to the jealousy and resentment patch. I'm a pretty badass mind gardener. Oh, did that say that? <laughs> <gasps> that is actually pretty good. These are affirminators. Affirmation cards to help yourself without the self-helpiness. So that is pretty cool. And look at that there little unicorn on the back. Positive thinking. In the garden of my mind, I water the good thoughts and weed out the bad ones. I throw in forgiveness and empathy seeds by the handful if I want. And I take a lawnmower to the jealousy and resentment patch. I am a pretty badass gardener. See, I don't usually say that word, but since it's there, I have to read it. Otherwise, the author of these cards would be sad. <laughs> and down here it says, Magically unlock the power of the universe. Kind of. Wisdom from about halfway up the mountain. These are fun, really. They are really kind of fun. Um, they're made to be kind of silly, but they all have a very powerful message. Okay, so I'm, that's what I'm going to do for right now. Oh, you know what I'll do is I'm going to close this up. So if I need to use some paints, they're still going to be moist. All right, that's it. May God watch over you every step you take, every move you make. And I will see you later on today with part two of what I'm going to do with this.
jump my water and find my mouse. There's my mouse. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Don't go down there and mess that thing up. Okay. God bless.